Hey friends, today I have got another simple basic math problem for you. The question is 20 minus 10 divided by 2 minus 4. If you think you know the answer, go ahead and drop it in the comments below. Alright, now here's something interesting. About 90% of people solve this problem and believe the answer is 1. But that answer is actually wrong. Why is it wrong? Let's break it down. What most people do is subtract 10 from 21st. That gives 10. Now the expression becomes 10 divided by 2 minus 4. Then they divide 10 by 2 which is 5. And now we still have this minus 4 here. So finally 5 minus 4 equals 1. So they end up with an answer of 1. But that's incorrect. The mistake happens because when solving mathematical expressions like this, we have to follow the order of operations. I am sure you have heard the rule PEMDAS or sometimes called BODMAS. In PEMDAS, P stands for parenthesis, E stands for exponents, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition and S stands for subtraction. So let's apply PEMDAS to this problem. 20 minus 10 divided by 2 minus 4. First, we check for parentheses, but we don't see any parentheses here. Next, we check for exponents, and there aren't any exponents in this problem either. After that comes multiplication and division. And yes, we do have a division here. 10 divided by 2, which equals 5. Now the expression becomes 20 minus 5 minus 4. Next we move on to addition and subtraction going from left to right. First 20 minus 5 which gives us 15. After that we just bring down this minus 4 as it is. Now we can do the next step. 15 minus 4 leaves us with 11. So the correct answer to this problem is 11. Did you get 11 as your answer too? If so that means you have got a solid understanding of PEMDAS. Great job. Now here's another problem for you to try on your own. 5 plus 5 times 2 plus 4. Go ahead and work it out and then share your answer in the comments below. I'll check and reply to let you know if you got it right. Give it a try and let's see how many of you can solve it correctly. Alright, that's it for today's video. See you in the next one.